Hi, I'm Michael Clark, and I'm the Mayor of the City of Maribyrnong. Friends, it's been a very busy 12 months, and we've worked to deliver something like $36 million worth of Capital Works projects right across the city. Council undertook $629,000 worth of internal and external renewal works to rejuvenate and preserve the rich history of the iconic Bluestone Henderson House building and that's as part of the Footscray Community Arts Centre. The Eastern Hockey Pitch at Footscray Hockey Club, that received almost $1.8 million worth of upgrade. And the brand new pitch now meets international certification and provides locals with a world-class playing surface. Two tennis courts at the Kingsville Tennis Club were reconstructed to enhance and support the local tennis community. New surfaces, all with synthetic grass, new boundary fencing, installed to support local competition, tournaments, and of course, the local social activities in the district. The long-awaited $12 million Footscray Wharf redevelopment began with the reconstruction of the new promenade between Hopkins Street and Footscray Road there in Footscray. It's due to be completed by May 2022. A range of parks and open spaces throughout the community were upgraded. We've seen a brand new $800,000 playground installed over there at Pipe Makers Park. A range of upgrades were made to existing playgrounds, including those at the Village Green, Pritchard Reserve and Ulmara Park. New irrigations being installed throughout Footscray Park. New shared path lighting, these were installed to enhance safety and visibility in a range of parks and open spaces. And this was part of a $520,000 project. A new 330 metre long path was also installed at Cranwell Reserve, providing pedestrians and cyclists with safe access to the Maribyrnong River Trail. We've seen Anglis Reserve over in Yarraville receive $1.4 million worth of new infrastructure. And this has included 23,000 metres of new turf, along with new lighting and drainage. Henry Turner North Reserve welcomed new lighting and upgrades to female-friendly change rooms and amenities. We've seen new electronic scoreboards also being installed. This is going to help local sporting competition. We put them in at Henry Turner North Reserve, Yarraville Oval, Pennell Reserve and of course Hanson Reserve. Throughout the year, there's been a range of road improvements made to council-owned streets. A number of these improvements include the reconstruction of the Gerald Street Footscray and Dudley Street West Footscray, and the rehabilitation of Austin Crescent West Yarrow. Intersection improvements, which see new raised intersections, roundabouts, and pedestrian crossings throughout the community such as the new intersection installed at Webb Street and Wales Street there in Kingsville. Cyclists right across the municipality now have access to safe bicycle routes right around the city. And these include in dedicated cycling lanes along Geelong Road service lane. And pedestrian accessibility right across the city has also been improved significantly with upgrades to a range of pedestrian footpaths. An outlook on the 2021-2022 financial year is going to see further developments, further improvements. Friends, it's been a huge Capital Works program, but we do this to make sure that the lives of our community are significantly improved year on year enjoy what we've done, all the best.